Hey guys, tonight Brooke and I are going to Mecca Bar Broad Beach. Uh, it is Persian Middle Eastern food. We haven't been there in a little while. We went once upon a time for a bite to eat for lunch, but it's been a little while since then. So we thought you'd bring you, we would bring you along and have some dinner with us. See you then. So we ended up making a slight detour at the Bavarian Beer Cafe just across the road from Mecca Bar. Uh, we had about an hour to kill before our booking. So we thought, why not grab a beer for myself anyway? At the moment, Brookie's off the booze. So yeah, just a beer and a scotch for me. And now we're heading over to our dinner reservation. So we'll see you there. So for entree, we grab some cute plates. <laughs> Do you like the plate? Yeah, for entree, we grab some, what's this, falafel on some type of dip. Let me try it. Oh, it's like a, a, a cheese. Like a, no, it's like a hummus. Like a hummus? Some type of bean hummus. But like a white bean, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, have to look at the menu. Yum, they look good. They're covered in sesame seeds. Yeah, they're covered in sesame seeds. Eat off the plate or not? Okay. Yeah, 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 okay. Take, take it guy over here to your place. Yum. That's really good. Did you do with sauce? Yeah, I did with sauce. Go try it without sauce. Yum. It's um lemony. Yeah, really lemony. Like must have like a heap of preserved lemon in it. And then the parsley on top is really nice too. Alright, you ready to try some prawns quickly? I don't know if that was shopping camera, but it looks phenomenal. We got some little red crostini things, some sticky prawns they were sold as, on a little bed of salad with some fried, no, just with some chickpeas, a little bit of caviar, and a taramata salada. Where's the caviar? There, see? A, a very small amount of caviar. <laughs> But the taramata salada is a salmon roe, so it's made with salmon eggs. Which is like caviar. Which is like, similar to caviar, but for salmon. Yum. You wanna go? Yeah, just give it a go. Moment of truth. Mm. Yum. Good. It tastes like, like 
like a honey soy chicken wing. Really? Alright. <laughs> it does. It does. Yum. It's nice though. It's a pretty pink colour, hey? Very girly. Yeah. Oh, yum. Oh. That's so good. You gotta try it with a bit of the dip. I know you're not a massive fan of fish row. But please, do yourself a favour, give it a little go. It's really nice. Yeah? I didn't get enough. Didn't get enough to actually try it. Yeah? I can't taste it. Can't taste it? I, don't th I think I'm having it with the garlicky bread. It's been cooked over, like it's yummy and crispy. I just don't feel like Yeah, look. You do it. Ah, Bit of sauce, bit of caviar, bit of parsley. Ooh. Get on there, guy. I'll tell you what I'm doing. It's, it's crunchy, it gives it texture. It's weird, isn't it? I know. Dropped a bit of the bread in the sauce. Alright, well let's get through these entrees and get prepared for our mains then. Oh, thank you very much. Perfect, thank you. Oh yum, hold up. Hold the front door. Oh, yum, look at that. Okay, two seconds. All right. So we have... Lamb. Lamb skewer. Chicken skewer. Beef short rib. Oh, yum, thank you. Yeah. And then there's like... So we got beef short rib, we got chicken skewer. There's some Lubna yogurt or something underneath. We have bone marrow and pita bread with some type of dip. A garlic aioli. But it's probably not being Persian. Gotcha. But well, it's maybe. I garlic, don't know. Very, very garlic. And then we've got some pilaf, which is like a flavoured rice. Um, which, let me. Want to try that? Good? Yeah. So lemony. Alright. Dig in, what are we gonna start with? I'm starting with the marrow. What? Yeah, I, got, I gotta start with the marrow. Hang You're gonna on. have some on the bread. I'll do the uh, lemon while you do that. You yeah. go. Okay. And I'll do the lemon on our. So we got some pita and then I guess beef or lamb. Oh, you have no idea. Yum, look at that. Oh my God, it's dripping. Holy, wow, that is, that is so good, it's just like, get your knife in there, why are you using your fork, oh my god, it's like so, oh, oh, try like a little bit like that, that's a more crispy guy, I don't want that much, yum, that is life-changing. I can't do that right now. No? Pregnant lady issues. Can't handle that. A bit too meaty. It just tastes like when you have a lamb loin 
little chop. It's the bottom of the chop bit, doesn't it? The fatty piece. Yeah. It's no. well. Put some, oh, well you bone, bone marrow is essentially just pure fat, so yeah. I'm surprised you got so much. That's, yeah, there's a lot of them. Look at how much is in that one. Yeah, wow. Oh. oh. It's just dripping fat. Squishy. Here we go. Yum. Yeah. Mm. It looks so full on though. It actually makes me excited. What's in there? Might be like apricot. It might just be the spices. Charred yeah, charred rice. Yeah. Do you want me to pull some of these off? Yum. Oh my god. Good. What is it? Yum. It's it's got a, a real sweetness to it, doesn't it? Bit of chicken dipped in it. Mm. Yum. It's like pomegranate molasses through it. Yeah. It's really nice and sweet. It has that really sweet. Yum. With charcoal. Oh my god. Yum. Short rib, cut that guy in half. Let's move this back. I'm gonna... pick it up. Oh, you... oh, look at that. The bone just pulls out. Clean as a whistle. That's unbelievable. Pull the other guy out. He just pull out. So heavy. Oh, there you go. oh wow. That's oh just peels off. That's a whole sh like two short ribs there. Yeah, um, take this off the skewer as well for us. Yeah. So this is the lamb. Yum. Hang on. Let me have a try. The charred lamb, this guy has a, essentially like a dry rub on it, which is, caught me by surprise, it's very cinnamony. Oh really? Yeah, it's cinnamony, 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 <laughs> cinnamony, cinnamony. Um, it has a little bit of heat to it, um, but it's not quite as juicy as I would have hoped. But saying that, I think I was just a pig and I went in. I went in with too big of a piece. And yeah, yeah, it's, the lamb might be a little bit overcooked, but saying that, the chicken, the short, everything else is spot on. Amazing. Flavors are good. Yeah, the flavors of the lamb are really nice. Just a little bit overcooked. Look, it is really busy here. You can't blame them. Try this. The short rib. Oh, put that whole thing, yeah, go fingers and all. Yep. Oh, wow, that's how soft it is. Oh, my God. That is 
That is wild. That is, oh, yum. That's sweet, tender, fatty, meaty. It, it, all the good words. It's all the good words. <laughs> it's got like. Oh, yum. Yeah? Yeah, perfect. Anyway, we're gonna eat. We're gonna get through this and we'll catch up with you guys later. All right, guys, so we have just finished up dinner at Mecca Bar in Broad Beach. Uh, the food was phenomenal. Where I'm really happy. Yeah? Same. Yeah? And we were filming the outro just outside the restaurant, but the camera cut out. So we're sitting in a service station car park right now, recording on our phone. So I don't know, it's all learning, I guess, for these, this first one. Um, plenty more time to figure things out, I guess. Entrees. Falafel, thoughts? I probably wouldn't get it again. I liked it, but I found it too dense. Too dense. Mm. Probably needed a nice sauce or something to go yeah, with it. It probably just, with the amount of food that we ate, it was just too much. Too much, yeah. The prawns? I like the prawns. I did the prawns. Sticky prawns. Mm. They were amazing. Uh, they were done in like a, well, like a honey, honey soy, soy sort of glaze on a little salad with some bread and some taramata salada, which was delicious. Mm. Definitely, I definitely get those again. And then the platter we got, which had the, mm. the chicken skewer on it. Mm. The chicken was actually, usually myself, I think red meat is the king of the meat world, but the chicken was actually really good. Mm. The chicken skewer was flavorful, quite delicious. Then we had the lamb. The lamb skewer was a bit of a letdown, to be honest. It's um, a bit dry. Yeah, just a bit overcooked. The like the seasoning on it? Yeah, that was nice. Nice, like it, was, it had like a bit of a cinnamony. But it was spicy. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah, it was nice though, but again, they were super busy, so we can understand that, you know, it might be a bit overcooked for whatever reason. The short rib. Short rib was good. Poor, oh, that was, I would, I'd go back just for that essentially. It, you know, if you, if you find yourself in the area on the Gold Coast, in Broad Beach, looking for a bite to eat, go to Mecca Bar Broad Beach and get yourself that short rib. You will not be disappointed. It was phenomenal. The rice was good, bread was good. The uh, marrow bones as well. Yeah. Not your cup of tea. For me, they were excellent. I really enjoyed those fatty, gelatinous marrow, one crispy, toasty, garlicky bread. Can't go wrong. Obviously for you, being pregnant at the moment wasn't really something that interests you too much, but I don't know, you did well, you tried it. I tried it, it wasn't yeah. my thing. It's a dinner that for us afterwards, we definitely didn't need a dessert. Mm. <laughs> yeah, the, it, was, it was a lot of food. We have a doggy bag. We, we, yeah, we couldn't eat it all. We took some rice and a little bit of the meat home. Um, saying that, for all of that, it was what, $140? So, not super expensive, not cheap, but sort of in the middle. But, I don't know, long story short, it was excellent. It's pretty good value for money, I think. We both walked out of there stuffed. As we said, we got a little bit to take home for brekkie tomorrow morning. So, yeah, all in all, good experience. Mm. Definitely, I'll definitely go back. You? Yeah, 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 I would. Yeah, perfect. So, anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. Again, this is our first video so we're new to very new to this so if you're watching this let us know what you think do all the normal youtubey stuff like comment subscribe and we'll see you on the next one bye bye